Welcome back to Streets of Rogue Big Quest, where today, we're doing the jock. <laughs> so this is gonna be my second attempt on this run. Um, I, as always, I explain how this character works when I play it, and I also kinda, I, this is the first time I'm probably gonna give my opinion of this character immediately. I don't know how I feel about this character. I was actually talking on Discord after my recent failed run because I was kind of curious like of what people thought of this character and like what how I should probably play it. So how this character works is that he has incredibly high melee. Is this threaten gonna work? Oh my god it did. Okay, well, um it could be worth like stealing this. Um I'm kinda curious because I I, I feel like I should just kill him anyway. <laughs> I feel like I should just kill him anyway, like, uh, the threat- I, I really- I really didn't feel like I needed the threat in him because I'm just- I just have such good melee stats. And also, I suck at firearms, so guns are the bane of my existence, using them and fighting against them. Now, on top of that, I have a special ability that I refuse to talk about, <laughs> and it's called the charge. So the charge is basically, I can run in a direction infinitely until I run into a wall like this or a metal wall. I can negate that effect with a new- with a, one of the special ability traits. Uh, so I can run through metal walls, but why would you want to, first of all? And second of all, like, it, this trait, honestly, in my opinion, might be the worst trait in the game. Or the worst special ability in the game. Uh, because, basically, it's too loud, it's too destructive. I don't know how this is gonna work. Oh yeah, I also have, I'm also one of the other characters in the game with the loud trait. So basically, everybody just hears me because I'm just this, like, hulking dude just wandering around. Alright, and that guy's probably gonna know who I am. Okay, he didn't. Interesting. Okay, I do get a free melee weapon off that though because he's got a knife. Okay, and oh, oh wow, he actually psyched me out there. Okay, and oh no, come on, Jesus! I hate it when the, I hate it when like my melee attacks just sync up so imperfectly that I just end up missing every hit and he nails every hit. All right. So as you probably noticed, I haven't used the ability yet like properly because it's kind of because I don't want to because I feel like like I said the trade is extremely destructive it could aggravate a lot of people there are a few traits we can we can get in the game that uh help nullify some of the negative effects that come the negative drawbacks of the ability and t one of them is clumsiness forgiven and the other is secret vandalizer so basically secret vandalizer uh will prevent it will prevent me from uh taking um Secret Vandalizer basically makes it so no one hears you break stuff, and believe me, this trait is, is this ability is extremely destructive. Um, in most cases, because if you're not careful where you're aiming, you might you might have trouble uh, stopping because you actually can't stop as that character when you start the charge. Um, then how how do how else can I explain? I had like I was trying to explain this in my head, and now I just like forgot how to. There's only three chairs on this entire floor. Watch them be like spread out everywhere, and I gotta go find them. All right. Um. Let's see here. We'll grab the syringe. We'll try both of them. Ooh, invincible. Thank you very much. Cool. I can just beast mode through this. And who needs stealth when I have invincibility? All right. Uh, die. Okay. Die. Okay. I said die. Okay. And now I got you exactly where I want you. There was a shapeshifter inside that guy. Okay. Well, hopefully a cop kills him and then I can reap the rewards of his dead corpse. So if I haven't mentioned it already, uh, the big quest is that we have to break a certain amount of a certain object on each floor because it's the, the big quest is called harmless pranks. Because this is apparently what you do as a harmless prank, is just destroy furniture mercilessly. Okay, die. <laughs> they already saw, they saw that right through the window. I keep forgetting, I have to take that into account sometimes. Alright, hello. Uh, bribe with items. Actually, threaten. Because threatening normally works as the jock. Okay, I'm sorry ma'am, I didn't mean to hit her. <laughs> Damn it. I did not mean to hit her. Okay, uh, let's see here. Where's the other chair? Danger is nearby. Um, well... Now we teleport away from the danger. Okay, let me just talk to you. That guy is completely screwed. Okay, you die. Okay, die. Okay, and all right. Uh, come on, come back here. I kind of want the money, honestly. Okay, give me that. 97 gold, and we gotta kill an office drone over here. I could just uh, we could keep this peaceful. Uh, leave. Okay. Well, well. Okay. This guy apparently he said no one threatens me, but apparently it's very possible to kill him. All right, they, I think the, this is the last chair I need to destroy. So that's that, and that's the big quest, and then I need to deal with this mission here. You know what, this might be a good time to use the special ability, because, uh, you know what? <laughs> now here's the problem. You don't want, you want to make sure not too many people see you do that, because, uh, this happens. You get a huge firefight, and, uh, you may be forced to pull out your strength pill and whack through everybody. And I also get some free batons, and that person just became a pussy and ran for it. We're going to use our free item voucher if there's anything useful here. I'm going to take the giantizer. Uh, okay, I already have 220 gold, and it's only the second level. Not bad. And this big quest should not be too long, um, as long as Juggernaut lost, lose less health while charging. 
I've never seen that trait before. There's a few special ability traits that go with this, uh, that go with the special ability charge. Some of them good, some of them are actually the first time there are traits that I don't want to take. Because some of them actually kind of mess with you, rather than help you. Alright, uh, what do we got going here? It's zombie time. Alright, um, okay, actually, this is one of those conditions where I can just charge through this building and just destroy it. Because no one seems to own these buildings. I don't know why. They're just, like, random buildings that no one seems to own. Okay, so we got some missions around here. Uh, let's see, let's grab that. I can't break the metal buildings without a trait called Tackler, and it's not that I'd want it, because then, once again, I'd have to take into account how far I'm running, because, like, I don't want to, I don't want to, like, mess it up too badly. Okay, come on, get out of here. Everybody beat it. Alright, and let's grab this stuff, and run into this building, and, uh, yeah, I guess I gotta navigate this normally. Hopefully, none of these guys have guns. Okay, you die, die, and... We'll destroy this generator for kicks. Do you have a weapon? No, you don't. There's no point in talking to you. Okay, die. And then we just have to activate this last switch, and then we'll grab the safe, and then we'll be on our way. Try the syringe, it's weak. Well, <laughs> can't expect all the ch all the syringes to be good. Sometimes I, I use a syringe, figure out what it does, and then I never see the syringe again, even when it's a good syringe. Like, Jesus. I wish I could identify ones more often. That's a, That brings up another idea that I wanted to bring up, because I was kind of curious of everybody's opinion. I was wondering how everybody would feel if I started, like, adapting the trait pool and the rewards pool again. Because, like, I used to have it adapted in my old episodes, but then I decided to enable all of them just because I thought it'd be more fun. But, like, I'm kind of curious if people don't mind me, like, adapting it, or, like, they leave it up to my choice, because I was kind of curious if I should. Because, like, I was kind of considering it, because I was like, you know what, maybe there's some traits that I keep saying, like, oh yeah, these traits are so useless, why do I keep getting them? And then, like, it's literally because I only, I, it was my choice to have all the traits available to me. Alright. Guns are the bane of my character's existence. I should be careful. Um, there's three armchairs here. Actually, I know exactly how we can handle this situation. We're just gonna charge right through this building and destroy all three chairs in one go. Alright, uh, let's kill these guys, and now the cop hates me. Stay away. <laughs> Stay away from me. Okay, and, uh, I have an axe. Okay, and I can charge through this. Yes. Okay, there we go. Nice. And he's getting attacked by zombies. Perfect. Lovely day. And we're just gonna use the speed to get out of here. And in six minutes, uh, the first trade is the first, uh, the first level is done. The first area is done. Br Burning bullets, long lunge, blaster survivor. I'm gonna take blaster survivor just in case any disasters happen involving me running into a generator. Okay, let's continue, shall we? All right, I need to I need to be energized because I've been doing a lot of talking. I was actually out with my friends late last night, so like I was like I needed like something to do. They actually. My friends actually brought up a very important question I didn't like take into account. Is like what I'm gonna do with my channel once I get into college because they were like, oh yeah, Danny, when are you making your last video? And I was like, my last video, what? <laughs> because okay, in my hiatus, I actually considered retiring. Uh, I actually considered retiring from YouTube uh, and just like leaving silently because like I didn't think like any it really mattered at that point. But then like I got really bored over the summer. Be and then like I just decided like you know what, fuck this. I'm just coming back to YouTube. Why is this gap not open? That's weird. There's like, it's like some invisible wall here. Okay, whatever. Probably a strange bug that I don't need to care about. Uh, okay, where are all the lamp posts? And where are the lamps? Show me the lamps. Okay. Also, I get in trouble for doing this. Um, surprisingly. Yes. Don't destroy public property. That's not exactly something you should do. All right. So I have a critter upper here. Uh, okay. If, can I get all these guys in one swing? Okay. No, I didn't. Okay. There we go. I got it in two swings. <laughs> All right, uh, is that all the missions? Oh, yeah, we're done. Okay, cool. Get me out of here. That was super easy. All right, there we go. As, again, I'm not using the charge that often, okay? D I'm sorry. I'm not going to use this trait that often. So this 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 could be a pretty brain-dead run. Okay, and, uh, okay, and get them around the corner, and get them around the corner again, and destroy the computer, and, uh, oh, the person I got to kill is here. Thank you for conveniently showing up on time. There we go. Welcome to your demise. And ammo processor is such a useful item for my character. <laughs> All right, uh, what do we got here? I got an electro pill I could take. And, uh, okay, and, okay, there we go. And die, die, die. Okay, no, you don't, you don't get the runaway. You, that's not how this works. Okay, uh, gun. Okay, sometimes I'll use the pistol because sometimes there is some barrel, yeah. Sometimes I gotta kill poison barrels and like, you know, I don't wanna stand too close to them when they explode. <laughs> I don't want to deal with that. All right, I need to destroy six of these things because there's six of them on the floor elsewhere. All right, can I threaten for this item? Okay, nobody threatens me. Well then, I guess I'm just gonna come in here and ask and ask this gorilla to t show you the door. 
Uh, can you kill him for me? Thank you, sir. Thank you for your time. All right, I got bulletproof vest. That's actually exactly what I need as this character because guns, like I said, are the bane of my existence. All right, let's go take this uh, optional mission here and grab that. Neutralize some folks for a for a nice time bomb. Exactly what I wanted. Okay, kill you. Um, honestly, I probably should have uh, used um, what's it called? I probably should have tried threatening them. Maybe that would have worked. Who knows? Uh, we'll never know now because I don't know. I think I could use Jock to threaten people quite easily. All right, and give me that time bomb. And uh, what's look like the so this like large black shade right here? I'm pretty sure is up something I can run into that'll stop me. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna charge right through this building. I'm gonna land here. This guy is not even gonna know what happened to him. And then I'll come back and slap him. <laughs> Give him a good slap with the sledgehammer to remind him what I did, what just happened. And we're done with this floor. Okay, so I'm definitely f beating this within- Oh god, that's such a good trait. <laughs> that's a good trait for this character. Because guns are the bane of my existence! <laughs> oh god, how can I describe this special ability? It's such like, it's such a weird special ability to use. It's probably one of the worst. It's like if Vanilla Ice from Jojo Part 3 couldn't control where he was going when he's disintegrating everything around him as he rolls around in a ball and just charges forward. Basically, that's what it is. Okay, um, I can get out of this pretty quietly. Well, okay, okay, and, oh god, um, okay, I forgot, uh, okay. Well, that was kind of a waste of a sledgehammer, honestly, let's be real. Okay, let me just go and destroy the last few stuff. What do we got going on here? I wish I had teleport happy. There's some free melee weapons in here, I might stop by later. Uh, okay, well, we can just charge through here, and, oh my god, I positioned myself perfectly to get out of there! Yes, 500 IQ with the special ability that I hate so much. Now here's the problem, since uh, I, do, I have this trait that makes me like, uh, I'm apparently so above technology that I don't want to use computer. I don't want to learn how to use computers, so I can't shut off the gas, but I can't shut off the security luckily, so I guess that's a, that's kind of a plus. Okay, I'll take the last bomb, get that resurrection shampoo, okay, thank you very much, alright, nice, and now that the fire's been put out from this guy's corpse, I can grab this axe, and uh, now we can actually go do what I was meant to do. Uh, destroy air filtration systems. Luckily, since I can teleport around, I can just complete. I can just teleport around to them instantly. So, uh, let's just leave before I get bothered by any of these people. There we go. Destroy that and destroy the one over here conveniently by the exit. Okay, watch yourself. Don't worry. That's the last one I needed to destroy. All right, and I'm not taking this trait. Um, actually, I'm super tempted to, but I don't want to. You know what? Okay, as long as I'm very careful. Okay. So basically, that's the Blaster Master of charge. Like, it, it's like, you know how Blaster Master is kind of an upgrade on your explosives to make them blow up metal objects? Basically, that's how charge, that's how Tackler works. So basically now, I can destroy uh, metal walls. Not these boundary walls, though. That's what I refer to them as because, uh, you know, they're, they're walls surrounding the entire floor. So that's what I call them, boundary walls. Destroy four trash cans. Okay, because I keep, I, I just realized there are trash cans around here. Sometimes I don't even think about it because they're just such an such oh okay well i oh god <laughs> okay um okay and turn around okay mm, stay away from me okay he's grabbing in the axe uh maybe we can like use the gun actually okay cool you, you, know, you gotta save on my melee weapons a little and i knew that was alcohol i actually i already knew that was alcohol that guy's just gonna get attacked all right that guy should probably be more careful all right i should probably go free this guy anyway because it's a key okay you get the hell away from me okay and great i'm only attracting more attention <laughs> Okay, uh, okay. Drug dealer, do you mind if we talk? Uh, I like this. And, uh, I think that's all we got. Okay, and, okay, and I just lost a melee weapon. I just accidentally killed my friend. <laughs> Great! Alright, uh, let's go destroy this trash can down here. Okay, well, luckily the pistol. Okay, thanks, auto aim. There we go, thank you, auto aim. <laughs> okay, uh, drop the cigarettes. Okay, let's, uh, let's, let's leave this area. There. Super confused about where I am. It was just such a high IQ play that they just didn't realize it. See, I can even have high IQ plays as the jock. See, sometimes sometimes it all just works out. All right, what's going on over here? Where's the last trash cans? I need GPS. I think GPS would be a good trait to have uh, to like help make this go by faster. I need to find some use for this. Sh uh, for this um, what is this? The perfume or the cologne? I need to find some use. I need to find a floor where it's worth using. Oh yeah. Also, I just realized I gotta destroy that thing. I was sneaking. I had a sneaking suspicion it was over here by this building. I know. I know the composition of the building. And you get the hell away from me. See, I, I hate it when people. I think I saw a Steam post of people complaining about vampires, and I was like, just be ready for them. What, what did you expect? Vampires just gonna let you walk away and not think like, mmm, that's some tasty blood I see right there. That's some hot blood that that person's got. 
of course they're gonna attack you that's why you always how i like to do it is when i pass a vampire i like to hold my cursor in the direction that they're like they're away from me so if they try to chase me i can just do that see i can just time it properly and do that all right refrigerator okay no one seems to own this building so i guess i'll just claim what's in here destroy this generator uh i, I think i'm probably gonna do soldier big quest next that one that one seems fun to do all right and nothing what's going on over here retrieve an item okay seems simple enough um do we have any do we have any buffs and you know what we we, we won't need it it'll be fine i do want to go find a drug dealer no one here has a gun do they okay we're gonna kill that guy first we're gonna funnel them all here and then they all they'll all stagger through that one like spot so i can get them all in one shot ghost giver thank you very much totally an item i wanted uh why do i have it did i forget to sell the oil canister okay give me the money and my inventory is once again full i have two translators that's really that's really annoying um I, i'm tempted to just leave abandon the ghost game i'm gonna abandon this bot this can of beer i need to lay off the alcohol because literally everyone in streets or streets of rogue lives off alcohol all right and like i said you gotta you gotta get them all into like a group because every time if you hit if you hit everybody with one swing it doesn't waste more durability than if you would with one person so it's always beneficial to try to get people in a little clump and then you slap them all and give them all simultaneously it's brilliant okay i'm going to regret this aren't i um let me just charge through here i'm gonna get some free damage on that guy i'm gonna get hit okay and where'd that guy go luckily i got a lucky hit on him okay that guy got a lucky hit on me all right and now i can destroy that destroy that and destroy this guy from down here and i got an accuracy mod not that i really need it um i only have one gun i'm only gonna need one gun this pistol's really the only reason i'm using this pistol is in case it i have to destroy stuff like poison barrels Okay, what does that syringe do? I'm mildly curious. All right, uh, you don't know until you try. Sulfuric acid, slow. Thank you, game. Another building no one seems to own. That's odd. Um, ow. Okay, get the banana. Uh, banana peels. Okay. Well, we can teleport to the exit. I feel like there's a refrigerator at this house too. Yeah, that's exactly what I thought. All right, and also the cellomatic. That's actually what I was looking for. Uh, okay. Can is there a way to make this? useful okay that person's coming out the door okay hi hi oh god they all have axes okay mm, mm. <laughs> there you go that's how it's done all right give me that whiskey all right uh take that and is this good no okay it makes it even worse okay i almost ran into that generator okay and oh god okay okay wait i can do this while i'm confused don't worry i've mastered the confused controls see i know what i'm doing don't just because i stabbed myself with a really obscure look okay well <laughs> Not everything works out how it normally should, okay? I didn't mean I didn't I didn't take that into account. Prickly skin, um, knuckly. Prickly skin, I guess, because uh I think knuckly it's like how often am I gonna be using my fist? I think knuckly is it's a I don't know how to how I feel about knuckly. I didn't want to go as far as saying it's the worst one of the worst traits in the game. But uh it might be, just because like so soon in the game, you like end up not needing like your fist. You just have melee weapons all the time. So like what's the what's the freaking point okay and uh we just need to run over here what is even the oh it's ooze okay so i should probably get the big quest out of the way as soon as possible kind of like build my way towards each quest because like these lampposts are pretty spread out all over the place okay the soldiers should attract this should attract the attention of the uh of yeah okay oh there's a shapeshifter there um uh, okay hello okay hello okay good and uh they're gonna examine that body and then what i'm also going to do is uh okay well how do I want to do this? These guys have guns, you know? So, okay, we're gonna do that. Give me a critical hit. Okay, good. Oh my god, that was excellent. Okay, perfect. That was actually perfect. Okay, are these guys hostile? Yeah, they are. Okay. These guys, are these two the shapeshifters? Yeah, this is the shapeshifter right there. Okay, cool. And give me the money. Okay, ow. Okay, die. You die, soldier. Okay, cool. And I get some extra stuff here, extra knives and whatnot. Uh, I don't really care what's in any of those rooms. There's nothing important in there. Uh, how many generators, how many, how many lamps are there left? There seems to be two more. And these seem to be the last two. And it looks like we're done. And that should put us in downtown in, in only 17 minutes. Not bad. Again, not really using my charge too much. I don't think there's really any much point to you. I think now that we get the downtown and uptown, there may be even less point in using it. Because, you know what? It's gonna get super obnoxious. Okay, remove traits. I'm gonna remove, oh. I'm gonna remove loud, and I'm gonna remove sucker. Uh, because I don't care about computer literate. I destroy all the computers I find anyway. Destroy exploding barrels. Only three. Is that really what the mi is that the mission over here? <laughs> oh God. Okay. Jesus. It scared the fuck out of me. 
Okay, uh, wait, actually, I only need to use my fist for this, don't I? Okay, well, I've messed up. I've messed up. Okay, cool. Luckily, the gorilla won't say a word to his friends, right? Right? <laughs> All right, what do we got over here? Actually, um, let's see here. Let's just make him, let's just make him, like, attack someone. Why not? Okay, let's, uh, let's do that. Haterate him. And, uh, let's, let's, like, come on, make, okay, can we, like, yeah, there we go. Now, <laughs> yeah, now he's gonna get beaten up. Hopefully. Wait, what the hell? Really? Wait, why are they all fighting? Okay, okay, well, now this is a battle royale in the mall. Uh, I wanna make, I wanna be here to make sure the deed has been done. Okay, die. <laughs> Great. Why do Why do I have to do my own dirty work? Damn it. That's not what I wanted to do. He's in the perfect position. Okay. There we go. <laughs> that barrel is in such a good spot. Okay. Shoot that. And let's see here. Are they? Okay. Well, now we gotta. Okay. Oh wait. I have window cutters. Uh. Okay. Uh. Cut this and destroy that. See, I could have charged it, but there's no point. <laughs> there's really no point. All right, uh, what do we, see, okay, did I run into a Celematic anywhere? Like, come on, I need a Celematic because I want to get rid of some of this stuff. Okay, there's no point, I'm getting chased by mobs here, I think we should just leave the floor. I, I think there's no point, there's no point now. Okay, so make a smooth experience, I'm just gonna save on inventory space and use the perfume right now, just because, uh, why not? So now everybody's friendly, I can enter this room, uh, at my own will, what do I need to do? Destroy beds, okay. Uh, there's probably gonna be an apartment nearby somewhere, so I could walk in here, ask them to leave town, cool, thanks for the warning, I'm out. And then, hey, sir, do you mind leaving town? Okay, well, that's not, that's a, okay, well, okay, well, now, if you're gonna play this way, guess that's how, we're, that's the game we're gonna have to play. Luckily, your friends were not around to notice this. Now, because everybody's friendly with me, I can actually enter their, enter some of their private property without their consent. So, wait, does it, does that count with pressing switches? This is gonna be a risky move. Okay, yeah, yeah, that changes a lot. All right, uh, okay, okay, whoa, don't wanna get hit by him. Okay. Oh, I just died. Oh, wait, I have resurrection. Yeah. <laughs> Damn it, dude. Really? Okay, well, that that's a learning experience. I should have probably already known that, though. Okay, so I used the charge to break into here and just grab this extra switch, and now I can just leave from this, this area. Okay, watch this big brain move. There, destroyed the computer as well along with it. I wonder if, uh, I wonder if that guy's, like, I wonder if that guy, like, doesn't like, doesn't like, oh, no, I think he's another enemy. Oh, God. Okay, uh, hey, come here, and gotcha. <laughs> you fool! You fell for the most classic blunder! Alright, and I, I don't know why they have explosive barrels in such narrow hallways, but what the hell was that? Okay, um, you know what? We'll just go with it. You know what? A lot of things happen in Streets of Rogue that I just say, just go with it. Alright, what's happening here? There's a bed in this. There's a bed in this building. Alright, um, this could be risky. Okay, so what we gotta do... Okay, I don't think there's anything too destructive in this direction, so we're just gonna charge this way. They're all gonna get angry at that guy anyway, so it's no big deal. Oh, the water stops me. Okay, good. Uh, th like like I said, they're all gonna get aggroed on that gangster anyway, so they're not gonna chase after me. I don't I don't think. Maybe I shouldn't go near that area again. All right, these guys should allow me in over here, right? Yeah. Okay, well now they hate me. Okay. Uh. Okay and. Okay, oh god, I'm trying to think what to do here. Okay, and, okay, I, I've made an exit for myself. Okay, making my exit, making my exit. <laughs> okay, well, I gotta be even more careful about that. I wish I had clumsiness forgiven or any of those good traits. <laughs> okay, hi there, ignore me, please. Okay, we're gonna destroy this bed. Uh, leave, okay. Hey, shoot that guy by accident. <laughs> nice, you fool. Alright, uh, where, where can we go? Where are the other beds? Okay, oh, wait, I forgot about this. Yeah, I forgot that there's heat over here. Where, where are the beds I'm looking for? Ah, I see, they're right here in the firefi firefighter department. Okay, well, all these people are slowly dying anyway. Let's see here. How do I want to deal with this? Um, I have friends, so what they could all do is... Okay, I don't want to be here when this happens, though. <laughs> I don't want to be standing here. Okay, guys, I'm going to need your help. Ignore the guy that just died. I'm gonna need your help. You're gonna all go in there and destroy the, the bed. Oh, okay, well, I could just have each of you individually. Okay, uh, you attack, um, you attack that firefighter and you attack the goon. Okay, <laughs> nerds. All right, there we go. So all that's gonna start happening. All the magic is gonna start happening. And, uh, okay, while the fight's going on, I can just step in here and uh, break the bed. Okay, there we go. And that's the big quest done. And uh, we should probably leave. And oh, my jocks are still here. Okay, good. Let's go, guys.
You know what? This was this floor was probably a waste of perfume. Like honestly, I I pissed off so many people. Okay, backstabber. Or butterfinger. I don't know which one I should have taken. I, that was my, that was a reflex. Ah yes, bounty. Exactly the the trade I want. The disaster I needed. All right, I'm officially out of melee weapons. Damn it. Okay. Come on, come on, dude. You can. Can you be a bit dumber? Oh my god. Jesus, it's way harder to gimmick them like this. Okay, die. Gee, no, he got away and he shut the door on me. Really? Don't worry, I got more, uh, I always have more friend phones and I also have hologram Bigfoots. I even have hacking tools. So if I need to, um, if I need to, uh, get some, get a super cop on my side, I can, that's always the easy way out. And pool tables. I am not really sure where they are, but I know there's a cell, there's a cellomatic that seems to be down here. Oh, it's in this building. Okay. There's a pool table in there though. So I guess we can always, uh, oh, come on. Okay, uh, okay, and, oh wait, was this guy that had bounty on me, a doctor? Okay, hey, dude, I just want to use this thing. Just let a, just let a homie use this. Alright, and either way, I'm probably going to kill you in a second. Okay, die, and then die, die. <laughs> Alright, there we go, because I need to unlock this door back here. I'm going to destroy this generator, and I need to destroy this pool table, because uh, that's part of the big quest. And once again, a doctor has stepped out of the building because she's decided that she wants to kill me. All right, uh, I'm just not gonna worry about it. All right, and, uh, okay, ow. Okay, if you hit me- Oh, God, they all have bounty on me! Okay, I didn't think of that. All right, uh, I didn't take that into account. Uh, oh, wait, oh, no, they're just shooting that person. Okay, I, I actually- I misinterpreted the situation there. Uh, we'll just kill all these goons anyway. Okay, there we go. Oh, wait, this guy did have a bounty on me. Okay, uh, yeah, exactly. All right, um, let's see here. Can I- <laughs> God damn, okay. And get over here. Alright, give me that. Oh, he also, had, he also had the item anyway. Uh, is there any pool tables I need to destroy in here? No, it doesn't seem like it. And I'm getting chased by the mobsters. So how you want to shake these mobsters is that we should definitely stand... We should stand near a cop. Actually, you know what? Why is there... There's not enough people affiliated with me around... Affiliated with each other around here for me to do this. Okay, then. Fine, be that way. Alright, uh, hit someone else but randomly. Okay, cool. Uh... You weren't supposed to run. You were supposed to defend me. Okay. Yeah. Uh, okay. Now they're now they're all fighting. Okay. And okay. I don't. I can't really afford to get hit anymore. Okay. That was a risky shot. All right. Uh. Hey, shoot one of these guys by accident, please. Okay. There we go. <laughs> Thanks, mobsters. Mobsters are super useful, especially if you can get them aligned with you. Okay. Uh. Okay. Hey, shoot this guy by accident. Okay. Cool. And uh, you get out of here. You fool. You wasted your ammo. <laughs> And that's the end of the floor. So as you can see, the game length is finally starting to pad out with the final floors here. So we're about to get into Uptown, which is going to take even longer, and the charge is probably going to become even more useless. Sprinter, charge faster. I'm taking floats like a butterfly instead, <laughs> because I don't care about the charge enough to use it. All right, so there's nine beds in this area that I got to destroy, and I can see some of them right now. This is already going to be infuriating. See, like, I could charge into here, but then again, that could easily lead to some problems. Alright, so what we're going to start with doing is we're going to inspire some hate. And then what we're going to do, we're going to poke here. And then this guy's going to get angry at his friend all of a sudden. And then they're all going to start a fight. And the super cops are probably going to come in and settle this. Oh, or not. Okay, well, we could do that too. Okay. And <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, then. Um, interesting. Okay. Can I, like, can I, like, destroy this bed? I can. Ooh, I can destroy these beds through the windows. Thank you. <laughs> All right, what's the chance that you're gonna leave? Neutralize. Okay, nobody threatens me. Oh no. Okay. Well, luckily, there doesn't seem to be anybody around here affiliated with him. And that su super cop had no idea what was going on. He definitely was not doing his job properly. All right, I need to retrieve an item from this guy. Honestly, we're just gonna make this simple. I'm gonna give you the slave helmet remover, and I get a kill healthanizer. Nice. That's a fair trade. Uh, confused. Okay, that's a good syringe I could use for later. Um, let's grab a banana. Where are the beds? I'm gonna leave my weapons behind and kind of like see if I can get away with some of this. All right, I should be able to get away with using my fists here. All right, and okay, we're gonna shut the door and we're gonna destroy the furniture and okay, kill this guy. Okay. Ugh. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna leave. <laughs> We're just gonna leave the area for now because they're super suspicious. Okay, no one seems suspicious. Uh, now I just need to destroy this room and then... Okay, and we're just gonna close the door here. Now here's the problem, this guy has got a knife, so things could get a bit complicated. And, okay, well, why are they scared? I'm, I'm not really understanding that. Okay, 
They are examining a destroyed bed. And, okay, now they've kind of figured it out. Now they've kind of figured it out. Okay, and give me this stuff. Okay, <laughs> now I just dip. All right, with Backstabber, this should be pretty easy. All right, I have a knife. Let's see here. And Backstab. All right, cool. And then where there should be a bed in this building, isn't there? Were you the only person here? Okay, it seems like you were. Okay, yeah, there's beds. There seems to be beds over on that side. Uh, oh, wait, I missed him. That's what happened. All right, luckily, the AI does not know that there's another way to get into this building. So we're just going to run over here. And uh, there's still a lockdown going on, so I got to be super careful. Um, oh, God. Okay. Oh, God. No, they figured it out. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I didn't think they figured that out. Okay. Okay, and we're going to hide in here. And, uh... Have they figured have they figured out okay yeah the jig is up the jig is up okay uh uh friends take the heat for me okay thank you i can't believe there's still more to do on this floor it's crazy all right and that's only the first floor jesus christ what <laughs> jesus okay this big quest is starting to annoy me see if it gave me secret vandalizer or clumsiness forgiven this would have made this run so much significantly it would have made it significantly like easier fire hydrants okay at least these are outdoors these are outdoor objects i have to destroy luckily all right, um, what's going on in here? Okay, here's the problem. We do not have much health. We need to probably find a doctor. Did I run past a doctor? That was the thing. <laughs> that, that was the other question. No, I think this is the confiscation center. All right, um, we should probably find a doctor. See, how angry are they going to get if I start breaking this? Like, is this, the, is this like the end of me if I actually do destroy this? Okay, they, they just get annoyed. All right, cool. You mind testing the syringe? What does it do? Strength. Okay, thank you. Uh, thank you for testing it. Um, you have a Necronomicon, I guess. <laughs> if you if you really like to, if you're really into that kind of stuff, I guess. Okay, and backstabber. Um, how much in trouble are we in right now? Okay, and uh, there we go. And okay, we've been spotted. Um, okay, can you fight? Okay, you have strength. Go. No, he wasted it all. Okay, and oh god, this could be bad. Uh, rock. Okay, good. He's run out of ammo. Okay, and uh, we can slice right through them. And okay, and there we go. Okay, I got some grenades. Oh, okay, thank you. Now, a good thing about this is that th there is no back door here, and no one cares about the switch. Okay, knock on the door. Okay, let me in. Let me in, please. Okay. Um, hi everyone. Okay. Uh, don't mind me. Uh, is there a good trait I can use here? Uh, I might be in a bit of trouble here. Uh, okay, we're just gonna, we're just gonna attack, okay, and, uh, we're just gonna step outside, kinda hide a little, super cop, I don't want the super cops angry at me out of all people, okay, and kill this guy, okay, and the super goon sees me, okay, we'll do that, and they say you better stop that, uh, yeah, I, I will definitely stop that, alright, uh, if they shoot me, the, that's what's gonna trigger the super cops, because I don't wanna let that happen. All right, and I was able to get out of that pretty cleanly. All right, um, let's see here. Let's teleport over to the clerk and uh, kind of relax for a second. Uh, I'll see what this alternate mission is all about. Uh, okay, we need to we need to go do something over here. We need to neutralize someone. All right. Uh, hopefully, I can um do this pretty cleanly. Let's see um let's see what happens. Uh, let's see. Leave weapons behind. Knock on the door. Can I heal first and then? Okay. Uh. Let's see here. Threaten. Okay, yes. That was luck was on my side there. All right. If, if that bouncer would have definitely jumped on me if that happened. All right. If I can go find some. Oh God. Okay. Uh. Jesus Christ. Okay. Let's see here. Uh, use the knife to destroy that, and then teleport away so they don't get too annoyed. This where's where's like a clear space where like a fire hydrant could definitely be placed. Okay. And there we go. And that guy is gonna start attacking me. All right, unless I find a building to hide in. I need to find a building to hide in. Uh, shit. Okay. Um, luckily, I seem to be faster than him, so that's good. Oh, God. <laughs> okay, we gotta hide in here. We don't... Okay. Okay. Now we have an understanding of each other. Um, I, w I do want to go back and finish that mission. <laughs> and I get the higher vouchers, and... Get me the hell out of here. Okay. So we got one more floor. I got full health. Um, this shouldn't be too bad. Once again, haven't really used my uh, charge because there's really no reason to at this point. Uh, I might try to see if I can find a drug dealer and get a critter upper because I might need that for the last stretch. All right. Oh, this is all I need to do. It's all right here. Okay, bombs are dropping. Look up. All right. Um, can land there maybe? <laughs> 
<laughs> All right. Um, how do I dare do this? Okay. Uh, let's see here. Confuse, slow. Okay. Wait. Oh, hold up. Hold up a second. Okay. We're gonna attack. Backstab. Okay. Oh God. Ah. Uh, <laughs> grenade and. Okay. There we go. And oh God. Okay. And uh, let's dance. Let's dance. And you're not getting away. Okay. Perfect. And we'll grab all this. Eat the banana. Okay. We got super lucky. Whoa. Hi. <laughs> Okay, there we go. Uh, now we destroy the chairs, and that's the big quest. Yes. Okay, made it easy for me. Bombs dropping—that's actually one of the most useful disasters in the game, probably, because like it'll damage some people like unintentionally, like so. <laughs> Something like that could easily happen. And uh, okay, well, what do we got here? Do I have more friend phones? No, I don't. Oh yeah, I used them up. Okay. Um, the switch. Okay. What? Okay. Ooh. Okay, destroy that. And uh, I'm throwing the mission. Because, like, I feel like my guy's not gonna survive. He's not. Okay. And, oh god, we got a lot of people hostile on me. And I just took a- I just took a hit from a bomb. That's embarrassing. Okay. And, uh... We should run around here. Make sure they have no idea where I went. And, uh, it looks like they have no idea where I went. And now they're attacking each other for no reason. Okay, whatever. Oh god, why- why? Why? <laughs> You've exposed us! <laughs> okay, then. Well, then. Uh, oh god, hi. Okay. See, here's the thing. I have no way to counter this. There's really no way to counter this. It's like, it's just guns. There's nothing I can do about it. Okay. It, it's just, all they have to do is left click. And then, okay, well. Okay, get out of my face. Get, you, get out of my face. Alright, um. There we go. Okay, what is going on over there? Do we have a group of people that are walking along the street that I gotta attack? Uh, oh, yeah, it is. Okay. Hey, walk, walk around the corner here. Walk around the corner. Yes! <laughs> Look at him! Look at him seclude himself from the group! Alright, I need to find a private place to kill him. Uh, okay. Can you, like... Okay, well... Okay, good. He's running even further away. He's running even further away from the people he cares about most. Then I finish him off. Alright, there we go. Leveled up. Okay, not bad. And then... What do we got up here? Looks like a mission involving a clerk, some super goons, and some office drones. Looks like it's a go- Oh, okay! Make it easy for me! Thank you! Uh, bribe with item. I have no idea- You can take the slow syringe, for whatever reason. I'll- you, I- I guess I'll leave you to it. Alright, and uh, I'm not a registered citizen, damn it. Uh, can we charge through this building? We could try that. Uh, you know what, I'm not gonna style it. See, there's a metal building right here, I would've crashed right into it. Alright, avoid him. And... Big quest, harmless pranks. Not bad. Uh, like I said, the special ability is like, really awful. I don't know how I would use it properly. Don't make me angry. Big bullets. Modern Warfare. Guess we'll just take Modern Warfare. I do have a lot of money. I didn't really spend a lot of money in this run. Um, I could charge past the guardrail, but once again, I don't have Secret Vandalizer or Clumsiness Forgiven. It's like, kind of pointless. Alright, uh, Hiring Vouchers, Confused Syringe. I won't need to, the translator anymore. Armor Durability Spray. I don't have anything to spray it with, so I guess it's kind of pointless keeping this around. Got some Cyanide Pills. That should be useful. Bribe, and let me in here. Alright, let's go Let's go take out the mayor. He seems to be in this one building here. There's maybe a building I could throw a cyanide pill in. Uh, it sadly isn't. Okay, so... Hmm, okay. I have a time bomb. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Well, this is definitely how this is gonna end. Alright, what we're gonna do... We're gonna do that. We're gonna, like, place that down. And then, uh, let's see if the how the mayor reacts to such a thing. Okay, hello. Um, I'm just gonna stand here and hope nothing wrong happens over there. And, oh my god! You saw how much health I got back from that? Okay, I is anybody gonna be suspicious? No, everyone in this building fucking died. And Chad is once again victorious. Alright, let's go give the speech. Alright, hi everyone. Look at all these people, look at all these people here to just come see Chad. I promise a chicken in every pot, and a man cave in every garage. Alright. <laughs> Everybody's getting super hype about it. Even the slave. Free wedgies for all nerds. Nerds. <laughs> okay, everybody's pretty hype about it. Where, where's the one guy that's like, wait a second, I'm a nerd. Yeah, and most importantly, a ban on all video games not entitled M Madden 07. I really missed 2007. <laughs> Damn. High school was the last time I remember being happy. Oh shit. Okay then. <laughs> Yeah, they're just gonna go with it. Just, just get hyped up about it. Okay, yeah, and so he died a horrific death. Died of a, a bomb explosion like just placed outside the house. Just, 
it, it's just no matter what happens the solution's always time bomb so everybody rejoice i got a new mayor but i became corrupted it's a circle of life no one cared because all that matters is partying down exactly what the jock does all right and that's the end of the game so jock um i feel like he's i feel like there are characters that like you could re replace him with that are way better like gorilla um, Gorilla plays definitely similarly to Jock with like its aggressive like melee attacks. But the thing is, is the Gorilla has a cool special ability. Jock's special ability is pretty destructive and it can aggro a lot of people super easily. And also the stun at the end can also be super obnoxious because you fall over for like two seconds and then like you have to recover to um, avoid like t to defend yourself. And you're, there's that span of two seconds where you can't defend yourself. And all the people firing guns at you, which is prominently the people you're playing against in the future floors, like downtown and uptown, because everyone has a gun at that point. And like Jock is so weak against guns that it's like really annoying to fight it with. Because like it's not like he doesn't have like, it's not like he has stubby fingers. It's not like he's incapable of using guns. It's just he's bad at it. And he's like super slow with it. And it doesn't do much damage. And like if you try to get closer, he just gets stunned back by all the guns. And like you saw that, right? That's why I was trying so hard to like gimmick them around the corners because that was really the only solution. So, all in all, Jock is not really my favorite character. It's like an interesting character to play as because I feel like a lot of people could do some interesting stuff with the charge. Uh, because I feel like there's some potential to it. I'm not even sure what the special ability is. It probably has a, a bunch of improvements to charge that I do not care about. Super special abilities. So let's go look at that. Uh, so basically, faster charge attack. Charge is more powerful. Charge does not cause you to fall when you hit a wall. The only useful uh, aspect of that super special ability. So anyway, that's the job. Next episode, it's most likely going to be Soldier. Uh, because I've been, I feel like Soldier is one of the easier big quests that I feel like I should have done by now. And we don't have many left. So we have Soldier, we have Scientist. We have Werewolf, and is that everyone? Or, oh yeah, Blood Gangster. I don't know if I'm going to be doing Blood Gangster, like, on camera. Uh, I'm not sure if people want me to. Because I think that will be everyone then. I think we only have four characters left. So anyway, I'll, I'll stay tuned for that. So thank you everyone so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Slap the like button if you did. And I'll see you guys next time on Streets of Rogue. Goodbye.